Okay, so one other thing that's really powerful, as once you enable this Jupyter extension, there's also this thing called Python Interactive. And this is a really neat thing that we'll use a lot in the course. So how this works is if I create a new file, and I'm going to create test.py. So this is just a Python file. And if I do the same type of thing where I've got, you know, say, um, this is going to be my, my test, and uh, uh, this will be my uh, import pandas as pd. And if I hit shift and enter, what this does is it fires up a terminal. Um, and this is, this is not the IPython interactive. But what we can do is we can actually link, instead of running through the Python at terminal, um, which we'll do a lot in this course, but um, sometimes you'll want to run through um, an interactive IPython notebook, especially if you're doing visualizations or if you want to view help documentation. So for example, um, if I wanted to do uh, the help documentation, help uh, pd.dataframe, I want to grab the help documentation. It opens it up in the terminal, but this is really difficult to see. Um, and, and I actually have to keep hitting enter to, to view more. So that's, that's not a very effective approach. So I'm going to hit Q to quit out of this. Um, a better approach is actually to run through an IPython notebook. And what you can do is you can actually run um, using this thing called uh, magic. And this, as soon as you do, um, the pound symbol and two two percentage signs. You can then click this button called Run Cell, and what this does is it opens up an interactive session over here, and it actually just ran the help documentation all the way down through here. So you can see I got my help documentation right here, um, next to kind of um, ne next to everything. So as I go down through, I'm able to uh, both run um, interactively. So if I want to do like one plus one and hit shift enter, that sent th this down to the terminal. Um, we can see the one plus one is right here. If I look up, it's one plus one. Um, but if I want to put it over here, I can actually even just uh, copy and paste. So control copy or copy this. So copy right click and or control V paste it and hit shift enter and it'll run it over here in the interactive uh, session. So it's pretty cool. It makes um, for uh, doing a lot of data science tasks that you're going to have to be doing, you know, coding in this course, but you're also going to be wanting to, you know, gain access to help documentation and make plots. I normally use the interactive session in order to be able to do that. Um, and then I'll, uh, as I'm doing my kind of more standard data science tasks, I'll use the, uh, the terminal and you'll see that as this course progresses. Okay. And I'm just going to delete these files now. So, uh, we don't need those for the course. I'm going to, uh, shift and delete these and, uh, we'll continue moving on.